Second, they finally finished the First Avenue protected lane. This ride is actually the brainchild of Streets Pack, which started it in 2014, following our great success in electing bike pedestrian friendly candidates to the city council. People like Ben Kalos, who we're riding to City Hall with this morning. Happy to be out here today. Bike to work, everyone. It's an awesome day, and you gotta bike to work. It's easier than ever. It's such a delight. I've been biking to work before there was a single bike path anywhere. So I, I know we need to do so much more, but I'm reveling in how much we've accomplished. I only bike everywhere, so I think it's great, but I also take people who haven't biked before, and I start seeing it through their eyes. We have a long ways to go, but we are making steps. I want for every New Yorker to be able to get to work on a protected, safe lane and make it safe for a bicyclist. So this is the biggest crowd I've ever seen. I think we had 10 people and we picked up people along the way. I can fit on your handlebars. I can fit on your Awesome. Love Patagonia. <laughs> bike ride, right? I look around this group, I see a lot of friends and allies. I think, you know, this is continuing to be an amazing biking city. We're now over 1,100 miles of the bike network. Yeah. It truly is about building from the ground up. It is about building a bike culture in the city of New York. It is what we should be. Uh, it, it is in the heart of what a great city looks like. I'm glad everybody's out here and I love it bike to work because all that traffic, uh-uh, that's just way, way bad. Because Transportation Alternatives and Streets Pack and Bike New York brought people together to demand safer streets for all users to demand better bike infrastructure. This is really unheard of to have so much local uh, government uh, and council members and even the last two mayoral administrations backing more uh, active transportation. It's healthier physically, mentally, for the environment. I mean, it's a win-win uh, all around. It's just now a matter of converting those who are behind the steering wheel to see the light. Uh, and not necessarily give up their cars, but, you know, to be more welcoming. <laughs> 